Hello children. Today our topic is functions. Function we use to perform calculation. Functions are inbuilt within the spreadsheet software. We will see how we can perform uh, a calculation with the function and what are the basics of function. Now I will type a few values here. These are containing within A1, A2 and A3 cells. If I want to find the sum of these, there is a function is uh, function is there for that that is called uh, sum. So how you can do it? Uh, if you are typing simple, you can type equal. Then the function name is sum. Open bracket and first of all you need to introduce what is the first cell. Uh, according to our this range first cell is a1. Then I will type a1. Why you can select the cell. Then we are next we are only defining the last cell then colon and you can click on here so uh, this is how you can uh, define the range for uh, most of functions okay first cell and the last cell so after that we'll see what is the answer here okay now uh, the result is produced what if i have you know some uh, few numbers here equal sum open bracket you can define first cell colon and the last cell. Last cell is a5. Press enter children. Now see whether you can you know get that result quickly. And uh, if you are uh, if you are finding total or sum using formula, you can notice each and every cell you need to uh, mention and what type of calculation you are uh, we are performing. That and also we need to mention. So the result is same but the problem is here you can see uh, mostly uh, formulas are long expression and here this is short expression you don't want to tell how what you had, uh, only you have to mention the function you don't want to tell you how to perform the calculation because that function knows how to perform the calculation and uh, uh, expression is very short but uh, formula if we talk so it mostly uh, it is lengthy uh, you have to uh, mention everything in here but this is very short sometimes we uh, we uh, we need function uh, say as well as formula too okay right now you know perform calculation we can use function and formula right uh, you got idea and are there any other method that we can get uh, uh, some here yes there's a place you can click on home you can click on here click on this icon is called auto sum then you may notice you don't want to type okay you get this the range it is selected now you can press enter yeah now you may notice uh, the result is produced okay if that uh, function is uh, if there is another different function Okay, you cannot press for every function. This one you, you have to uh, click on the cell where you have to get the result. Then click on this arrowhead. Some uh, recently used uh, functions you can uh, see it here. If that is not available here, you can click on more function. Then you can click here all function or either any category that you know where the function is. You can click one of this. I'll select all. Think whether my uh, what I we only know yet uh, some function. Click here once and press S letter S until you meet uh, the particular function. Yeah, I got the function. Then you can press OK. After that, you need to select the range. Okay, just I selected. Now you can see the range is there. Or either you can type here and press OK. That is how we can get a function if that is not available here. For our case, we are not going to click on that location here, which you, we which we can get this function because uh, exam we need to write. Okay, so because that we need to you know type and get experience, and that is most best. All right, children. Now, uh, uh, then you need to uh, write down this one. This is your first example, how you can uh, work with the function and how you can work with the sum function, same time. And the second example is a uh, few. Now, I think you need cell uh, naming, or 
whatever you have you know learned in the first or second uh, video so i need to add this all then i'll type equal sum then you know first cell and the last cell the first cell within these two columns is this one all and the last cell is b4 uh, cell now you can see the whole area is selected correctly then the first cell is uh, this type of uh, range a1 and the last one is b4 already you learn about how to name it press enter you got the answer then uh, next range we will think this okay and think i have another few value here uh, and here how can i add this all think whether this is the place that i want to you get the answer equal sum open bracket uh, you can select this range first cell and the last cell first cell is a1 the last cell is b4 after that you need to put a comma then you can say this range, the D column range, what is the first cell, what is the last cell. First cell is D1, put a colon. Uh, so after that, last cell. So put a comma. After that, you click on the next uh, cell. Then we don't have a big range, only this one. Put a comma, the last cell. Okay, done. You can press enter. Uh, you got the result. And same time, uh, quick, uh, quickly, if you want to see the result, you can select all the numbers. You can see in this status bar, uh, sum is there, count is there. How many number of uh, uh, how many numbers we have typed here? It counted, and the average also, right? Uh, and uh, and I think better uh, you practice this one and get it to your mind how you can perform calculating calculation with the function. And apart from that, you can define in this way too. Okay. This one, comma, this one, comma, this one, comma, this one, comma, like that. But it is long method. And uh, this way also it produce result. And this one also correct regarding functions. But uh, function mostly we can write it very, uh, without any length and you don't want to introduce all. But uh, this method also correct and keep it in your mind. Most of children, you know, made a mistake. Uh, sometimes uh, I got experience in checking of these papers. They type uh, total and try to, you know, select it like this and keep it in your mind. There is no function is called total. Strong. Okay. And uh, what will happen if you define it this way? This cell plus this one plus this one plus this one i will close it so after that whenever you uh, press enter whether it produce the result yes that method also correct but the uh, de uh, mentioning like this making it lengthy so time wasting case but this is not wrong okay and uh, the best method is children according to i taught so that is first cell and the last cell right now we will learn now you know how to work with uh, a function and the, what is the basic of that we will learn about how we can work with few functions right so first uh, i'll type uh, the data which is which i want to you know uh, work i'll get you know one quarter months and i'll type some income I need to find the total then I will type here total everybody knows how to find the total now using function you can open bracket and this range this is the first cell that means C2 and the last cell is C5 uh, you can type or either you can select if you type C2 I said that it doesn't matter that is simple and the last cell is C5 uh, right now it is selected I'll press enter you can see this is the total Next, we are going to talk about a function is called average and uh, short uh, average, the function is average, open bracket and you may notice here uh, the number one, number two, like a, a sum, how we did if you have, you know, many columns, the same similar technique, you can use it here. Now, equal average, uh, here also you can <coughs> uh, uh, select the first cell and the last cell press enter and this is the function equal 
leverage the first cell and the last cell you don't want to tell uh, like uh, when you are performing formula this cell this cell you add and after that divided by number of uh, steps in there like us you don't want to uh, inform only the range the function will do the work right this is uh, the functions of this uh, uh, when you're writing you don't want to write the answers here only uh, you have to write these functions then uh, getting average there is another uh, I'll teach you another two methods uh, the second one is you can write here sum then you can define here number of uh, uh, the, what is the range and you can see now four step is there and you can ask to divide by four then you can you can get the same result here okay let's see is that correct yes okay what did i do here you can understand i asked to cal uh, get the sum and divide it by four so another method that you can define uh, average next i would like to talk about how to find the maximum value within a range then the function is max open bracket and select the range children and close the bracket then press enter you you can experience here what is the function and if you have you know uh, several columns you put a comma and you can select and you can you may notice uh, C5 uh, cell answers the highest in here. Okay, right, this is the function. And next one is how to find uh, minimum answer. So equal mean open bracket the range. First cell and the last cell, like earlier. Press enter. This is it. The next uh, function is large. What is large equal large open bracket and you can see in this uh, syntax uh, it is uh, displaying you array and the k array means the data range and I will type here 2 then it display me 5000 5000 is the second highest value so max always uh, finding us the highest value so think that I want to uh, find uh, third highest value, tenth highest value. Likewise, if you have you know lot of data, so that how you can find it, you can type equal large. This is the range. I need to find second highest. If you type it here, it will. Uh, if you type it here three, it find you a third ha a highest value. Okay, it's very simple. I practice it. And the next one is small. Uh, the function is uh, small open bracket and you can select the range as uh, earlier right i would like to find smallest third value press enter you can get experience uh, here smallest third value is from the smallest one is this one the next second smallest value is this one third one is this one okay Okay, next function we are going to talk about is count. Okay, right now equal count. I'll select the range and press it. Oops, I made a mistake. I think. And open the bracket. Select the range. January to April. Press enter. Now it counted number of step in here. There is another function, children. Counter. Okay, what did do? Equal counter open bracket and select the data range. Uh, so close it. Then you may experience the both will uh, counter the steps in there. What is uh, why we use it? This both uh, function use uh, we can use it to count the number of steps uh, whatever we type, right? So I thought of deleting this value now you all may experience here uh, it uh, the count and count are produced three because the in that range it uh, both of them we can understand it never uh, calculated or counted these uh, empty cells uh, whatever we have typed it is counted here uh, the type things are only the numbers what if I type here a b c one two three something one two okay now you can see count Count uh, displaying us here three, 
and it already selected the correct range you can understand and this one uh, displaying 4 now what we can you know suggest here so uh, uh, count only count numbers and counter count numbers and text what we type as example here uh, C O U N T A counter and I will select this whole range you will see whether it will count properly now it says here 13 because there is a no cell here started from 1 up to 14 is there one cell is not there so then 13 is correct that is uh, about counter what if I delete this one and press enter count never count text that's what you'll have to you know keep it in your mind right now uh, the function here regarding this one is count and here right I said I will show you another method which you can you know uh, perform average that is equal sum the range is this one and I will close it then I will type uh, divide division symbol after that count or count according to your work you get count function oops count open bracket select the range close the bracket now we will press enter it got this result i'll type 2 to 20 okay likewise that you uh, you can understand here uh, what happened is uh, it calculated the total count uh, count calculate the number of step in there then this one produce 4 this one produce sum and it, after that it will divide you can see division symbol is there uh, up to here you write down all the notes and these functions and practice perfect don't get from here better always type and get experience and uh, keep it in your mind these uh, functions practice this and write uh, write these uh, functions and this exercise in your book thank you children